Hi, welcome to our video on the five important things that PR is not. This is Jennifer Vickery with National Strategies Public Relations and wanted to introduce you to the five important things that public relations isn't so that you can in turn use public relations in a better way for your company or organization. There are many reasons why companies hire PR firms. Companies like yours may be offering a new service or product or plan to expand into a new market. They may require assistance with a crisis or want to tell the world how great their company is and why people should do business with them. Regardless of the reasons, one thing is clear. Companies big and small want PR to be all about them. Okay, the first thing that PR is not might sound shocking and a bit harsh, but it's simply the truth. PR is not self-promotion. They call it public relations for a reason. It's time to empower organizations to build relationships with the public, their consumers, clients, and stakeholders. It's a time to interact and engage with their audiences, build their brand and brand equity. It's about what audiences want, what they need, a solution to a problem, a service that saves them time and money, or a product that helps them become more efficient. It's about how your company fits into their bigger picture. Second, PR is not one directional. Traditional media is wonderful. After all, what company wouldn't enjoy being in a local or national newspaper? But in our ever evolving world of media, traditional PR is just one component of a communication strategy. As PR experts, it's our responsibility to ensure your promotion is multi-directional. Digital PR, including search engine optimization, is a critical component, as is social media, online blogs, rating sites, review sites, and more. Relating to your audience online is a multi-directional source, and that is key for your business. Third, PR results are not immediate. This is the one point that can be really tough for companies to digest. In most cases, PR results do not happen overnight. There are many times when we're able to quickly defuse a crisis or secure immediate media opportunities. But for the most part, PR strategies involve a ramp up period. We need to understand your culture, which involves getting to know you, your company, and what makes it, well, special. Fourth, PR is not advertising. It's easy to confuse PR with advertising, especially if you're trying to gain exposure for your company. Advertising is paid placement, meaning you pay to place your company on a banner or on a TV ad or newspaper, for example, or really any other communication channel. Whereas PR placements are earned media, meaning we contact journalists to report about you, which in turn provides a much higher level of credibility than if you paid to be included in that publication. Last, PR is not a one-way conversation. PR must be a two-way conversation that includes a collaboration of ideas and a mutual respect between the client and the PR agency. This is our favorite point because when we become part of the client's team, it has a powerful impact. We uncover so many stories that they had no idea were even there. These conversations drive us, inspire us, and ultimately lead to our greatest media achievements, which lead to our clients' greatest media opportunities. When that happens, our clients are rewarded with new business opportunities, a stronger brand, and a renewed passion for what they do. Major media opportunities also tend to make them smile. And let's face it, they make us pretty happy too. If you'd like, to find out more information on how we can help you with your PR strategy, find us at nspublicrelations.com. Thanks from your team at National Strategies PR.